These are the grounds of Crystal Palace, formerly known to house the great exhibition during the Industrial Revolution. Today it was a buzz with children and families amidst the sweltering heat, lining the roof with Union Jacks and here to witness the atmosphere of the 66th day of the torch relay through Bromley. Sponsors and Olympic officials handed out cheering balloon sticks to support the torchbearers. The exchange of flames took place at the stairs of the former palace grounds and was later carried down into the National Sports Centre. The sound of music, excited chatter and whistles filled the air as the torch made its way to Croydon, up Annerley Hill, followed by a parade of London 2012 sponsor behaviors. Contrary to last week's reports on shortage of security, police were out in force making sure the atmosphere was fun, safe and enjoyable. Many who were here this morning to witness the torch relay admitted such opportunities are rare and were simply delighted to be a part of the event. Um, today is my first day to see the torch. I'm so happy and delighted and especially the weather. The weather was so fine. I'm so happy. <laughs> With only three days to the Olympics, it is little wonder why Londoners are unable to continue their excitement. In Crystal Palace, this is Charlene Rodriguez.